Good morning, how's everybody doing? Today we're starting the vlog from the kitchen. I'm Mike, this is the Autovlog YouTube channel. Here's Sosa, what's up buddy? Hey, what's up Fluffy? Whoa, what are you doing? What? No, buddy. He's the fluffiest cat in the world, also the most schizophrenic. Love you, dude. <laughs> All right, so today we're gonna do a bunch of fun stuff. And surprise, surprise, we're not taking the Mercedes. I wanna drive the Fusion today. But before we do that, we're gonna open some mail. I went to the P.O. Box after I got back from Miami and we got some stuff to take a look at here. Okay, so the first uh, package we have here is from New Zealand. Hand Jive, the fastest bottle opener. Hey Mike, you make the coolest videos on YouTube about fast cars and I make the fastest bottle openers for cool people. So please enjoy my latest creation, the Chrome Widow Limited Edition. All the best, Neil Boddington, Hand Jive Principal, handjiveopeners.com. Take a look at this thing here. All right, comes in a cool little pouch. Open it up here. Oh, wow, yeah. It's definitely a cool looking bottle opener. I'll have to uh, try that out. Thanks. All right, so the next package here is from Mudit Patel in North Carolina. So we got a little note here. Hey Mike, I love watching your videos and I love the way your car came out so far. My goal is to be able to buy my dream car just like you. I have an online shop and I wanted to give you some accessories for your car. So I've included a magnetic phone holder for you. I will be giving a limited quantity of these away for free. Just pay shipping to any of your subscribers. I really hope you enjoy these gifts. And if you don't mind, could you leave the website link in description in your videos so people can find it easier? I'll leave it in this video here, I promise. Exotic-car-lovers.com. Definitely check them out. Let's uh, see what it was here. All right, so we got some cool little uh, keychains here. Actually, Ford keychains. So that fits this video well since we'll be driving the Fusion today. Ta da Very nice. All right, and then we have the, I guess, the uh, phone suction cup mount holder thing here. We'll check that out. Oh, wow, yeah, this one's small. I like that. That's pretty cool. Oh, yeah, check this out. I'll definitely try this out. Thank you so much. Everybody, if you're interested in this, check out the link in the description below this video. Then we get to this package right here, which I don't completely trust 100% here. All right, so this is a square box. It says this side up. It's from the infamous Andrew on Instagram. It says, do not shake. We'll open this over here. I don't want anything exploding on me. Okay, so we got a note here filled with sand. I hope you like the beach in a box. It's my way of saying, take time to enjoy life. I enjoy watching and love your videos. Check me out, the infamous Andrew. Stay classy, San Diego. So that's actually pretty cool. I got some beach sand in the mail in a box. I do, I do enjoy that. Um, I love the beach. Just came from Miami, as most of you guys know, although I didn't visit the beach very much. But this box is filled with sand. So pretty cool. Thank you, infamous Andrew. All right, so that's that. So we're gonna continue on with our day here. But if you, for some reason, feel like you want to send me something, the P.O. Box address is. You can also find it in the description below this video. But yeah, unfortunately, fall is upon us, but we can't really complain because where I live in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, we've had an amazing summer. It pretty much stretched out way into the fall months here. We're at the end of October. In about a week, we'll have November. It's still about 60 degrees. But yeah, today we're driving the Fusion. And why well, you're not driving the Mercedes, Mike, because it's been raining a little bit? No, it's because I put 2,800 miles on the car in one week. So I'm gonna let the baby rest here for a little bit. And I missed the Fusion. That's a nice car. And a lot of you guys have been asking, why, how come you don't make videos in the Fusion anymore? So we're gonna make a video in the Fusion today. Remember when we used to start every video like this? So did that ever get old or do you guys still want me to incorporate that in the videos? So since I don't drive this car very often anymore, every time I get into it, it's just so comfortable. Although my, my new AMG has the comfort seats, it's, they can't compare to this one. When you get in this car, it's like you're stepping into a freaking recliner. 
it's this car is so nice to drive it is so comfortable obviously they they're not comparable the two but it's just a nice contrast and I, I miss this car if you're new to the channel you might not know that I, I did a, a few videos in this car that got a lot of views and it did a lot for my channel and this car has just been good to me I've definitely been rough to it uh, <laughs> You know, throwing uh, transmissions in reverse and park and stuff while driving, taking it mudding and all that stuff. And it's never really cost me a problem. Uh, it's definitely built for tough. So, I, you know, I can't complain whatsoever. But now we are on our way to Best Buy because it's time for another giveaway. Time to go get a prize. Wow, they redecorated in here. I don't know how to find things. I know what I want though. I think this is gonna be really cool. Whoever wins this um, can take some really good shots. All right, so there we have it. I'm gonna jump in the car here. I'm very excited to show you guys what you can win in the next giveaway. All right, so to enter the new giveaway, all you have to do is hit that subscribe button right now. Remember to hit the bell icon as well right next to the subscription button. Now I'm gonna to touch on that real quick. I did a video, it was almost a year ago now, that I was telling you guys that many of you were saying that you were being unsubscribed from the channel unwillingly. I don't know why that is, but for some reason people get unsubscribed every now and then. And I thought that issue was handled by YouTube, but I guess not because still I get people telling me I was unsubscribed from your channel and I don't know why I didn't do it myself. So if you wanna be sure to get all the notifications on the channel, make sure you hit that bell icon next to the subscription button. Now the next step you need to take is follow me on Instagram at autovlog because that's where I'll be drawing the winner in this giveaway. So all you need to do is subscribe, follow me on Instagram, and you are automatically entered into the drawing in this new giveaway. So here is the price. Boom. DJI Spark drone. Just picked it up. It's brand spanking new. So maybe you want to start a YouTube channel or maybe you have a YouTube channel already and you don't have a drone or you already have a drone, but you want another one. Now you don't have to have a YouTube channel either. Maybe you just want a drone. It's super tiny, very portable. Yeah, this thing's badass. Since I got a drone myself, I mean, it's just the shots that you can get. If you guys saw my previous video where I filmed over uh, a bridge in West Virginia, it's just absolutely amazing. I love having a drone and the cinematic shots that you can actually do. Now I'll be drawing the winner in two weeks from today. So on Monday in two weeks, I don't know what date that will be, but that's where I'll be drawing the winner. So remember, subscribe, follow me on Instagram, boom. Come on, man. <laughs> All right, we need gas. If you're new to the channel, you might not have seen a video that I made last winter called uh, how far can you actually drive on zero miles till empty where I drove my car after it hit zero miles till empty to see uh, how far I could actually get it's a pretty cool video check it out I'll link it here somewhere and I'll put the link in the description as well all right 16 gallons $44 later we're filled up anyhow we're in my old stomping grounds here moon township where I used to sell cars. Because there will be a time here uh, in the coming months where I'll get rid of this car and it will need replaced at some point. So why don't we just stop by the lot here where I used to work and we'll take a look at what they have. And when we've done that, we're gonna talk about why this car is the best car I've ever owned and why it, in many ways, is better than my Mercedes. Here they are, Moon Township Ford. And we've talked about this already, the truck will need replaced soon as well decisions decisions bunch of explorers they haven't really changed this is the ford flex i love the ford flex a lot of people think it's ugly it looks like a hearse and all that but that's a great riding car look at that they have a used mini here what is that a countryman clubman whatever they're called here we have a magnetic colored ford fusion sport we've got a quick look here oops all right, so this is where I used to run around, talk to customers, do my hustle. That's not what we're doing today. So I reviewed the Ford Fusion Sport uh, about a year ago, or well, more than a year. I like it, definitely faster than what I have right now. Uh, 
however it's not a sports car whatsoever anywhere close to it it doesn't compete with like the audi s4 the bmw 340 like i thought it would um, however it's a great great car now that would obviously be something that i would consider because i want like an all-wheel drive car so i can drive it in the winter and stuff obviously i can't drive the mercedes in the winter here we have a platinum white one very nice i don't even know if i'm going with the ford yet but i, I think so my man z is driving a c max definitely not getting that and then obviously we'll be replacing the truck at some point here don't know exactly what we'll get though but how about you guys just leave me some suggestions in the comments below of what you think i should be replacing this baby with early next year yeah i mean we're looking at about four months stupid rain obviously i would want it to be something practical um all wheel drive it doesn't have to be super sporty or anything like that but yeah the weather is not really allowing me to walk around the lot here so as soon as it lets up a little bit let's talk about all my cars and why this one is the best one there's the new f-150 by the way i like how they have the f-150 uh badging or whatever engraved in the tailgate it looks good not a huge difference in terms of styling that's mainly in the uh, front of the truck here. We'll, we'll do a quick lap and take a look at it. I actually haven't reviewed an F-150 in forever. So what do you guys think of the new uh, grills, the new front end of the F-150s? That's obviously an XLT with a chrome package. You can tell by the grill. That's an 18, same there. That's a 17. And here we have an XLT trim with the sport package, meaning there's no chrome whatsoever. I like that better. Now this is very interesting. See the guy taking pictures of the new cars here? That's a Ford Edge. That used to be my job here. <laughs> I got an extra little spiff every month to take pictures of the new cars. It was, a, it was a great gig actually. I don't even know who this guy is. All right, so here we are back in my garage. And we're gonna talk about why this car right here is the best car that I have by far ever owned. But to do that, I'll take my very Swedish IKEA umbrella and we're gonna walk outside. It's not really a drop my GoPro. It's not really about me. I can just pull my hoodie uh, over my head here, but I don't want to get my camera wet. So this is my 2015 Ford Fusion Titanium. For those of you who don't know, I love the color. It's called Bronze Fire Metallic. It's a titanium, top the line trim. It's got ceramic leather interior. And these seats, as I mentioned in the beginning of the video, are extremely comfortable. Now, I've had this car for um, almost three years here soon. You know, this is stupid. And I have 32,000 miles on the car. During the time that I've owned it, I've had pretty much zero problems with it. The only thing I had to uh, replace on the car were the tires after 23,000 miles. Which, yeah, it was a bit of a bummer. But with everything that I've put this car through, all the videos that I've made with it, it's been extremely reliable. Unlike some other cars that I've owned. Now the videos that I've made in this Ford Fusion is mainly what made my channel grow so quickly. I have a lot to thank because of that car right there. Not only has it made me a lot of money, it's also been, as I mentioned, very reliable. It's been a great third car. Uh, for my family and I since after I got the Mercedes. My wife's been using it, although she loves our truck. It's just been an awesome car to have. Did I have some complaints about it uh, at one point? Yeah, I did. I mean, no car is perfect, but all in all, if you look through the ownership experience of all the cars that I've ever had, this one by far is the best. Now, is it as exciting as the AMG? Hell no, absolutely not. That car is the future of the channel, and it's my dream car, as all of you guys know, and I can't wait to have it for a very long time. Now, although this specific one I've only had for about a month, most of you guys know that I had a 2017 before that, and from the ownership experience of these two AMGs that I've had, they brought me tremendous amount of joy, but also a lot of stress. This car has not brought me any stress whatsoever. Except for maybe those few times where, you know, I was playing around with the transmission while driving and stuff. I wasn't 100% sure if it was going to, you know, work afterwards. But it did. So this car has been a complete rock for me. And when it's time to give it up, because it is a lease, uh, when I do return it, it's actually going to be a sad day because I truly love that car. 
Uh, a lot of you know automotive YouTubers will make these corny ass videos where like, oh, goodbye to my car. But it's, it's honestly going to be pretty sad when I let that car go. But we will be keeping the car for at least another three or four months. But after that, I am unsure exactly what will be happening regarding my car situation, if I'm going to replace it right away. What I do know, though, is that the day that I return this car to Ford Motor Company, I am definitely going to miss it. So whether you like Ford or not, for me, this car has definitely been... But that's gonna do it for this video here. Just wanna remind you guys that I'm extremely excited about giving this Mavic Spark away to a lucky winner. I love doing these giveaways. So remember to subscribe if you haven't already. Also follow me on Instagram and you will automatically be in the runnings for the Mavic Spark. But for those of you who have been with the channel for a long period of time, let me know which your favorite Ford Fusion video has been throughout the years. And before we end the video here, I did notice that the guy that sent me the keychains in the mail also sent me an AMG one. I didn't see that in the beginning. And this is really cool, so I'm definitely going to use this. So thank you so, so much. But once again, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys very, very soon. Bye-bye.